that he was, was going to come over there at a certain time and had me and my mom standing up waiting on, waiting on him to get there. So he was like, he just going to come tomorrow, which was a Saturday, at a certain time. So around the time that he was going to come, I was like, are you on your way? Because, like I said, I was trying to make sure my mom was at home, so she would take him downstairs, take Clover downstairs to see him, so I won't have to go down there and see him. So my mama, no, that Saturday I texted him and asked him was he still coming. He sent another long ass paragraph to my drop her off over his house. Her immune system, if she gets sick, her immune system gonna fight up. I just, just a bunch of bullshit like. A bunch of bullshit. And my answer again was no, like, Clover was only two weeks old. And I'm gonna keep saying this shit because y'all need to understand I was not finna drop my baby off. Nowhere. She hadn't even left the house. When I got out the hospital, I didn't leave the house with her until the day she had to go get her shots. That was that Saturday. He said he was gonna come. So me and my mama, once again, sitting up at the house, waiting on him all day to get there to see her. Never came. Texted me and was like, um, no, he say, no, Saturday, he was like, send a location because he was going to be on the way. It was late as fuck. I don't even remember what time it was. But he knew where the fuck I stayed at because he didn't call Ubers to my house. For, like, why are you trying to ask me for the location to my house? And you know where I stayed. So Sunday, he texted, and like, he texted me that morning. And was like, he was going to be on the way or some shit. This is shit he was talking about. That video that y'all had seen me. What? Oh, fuck, you been here on live. I'm thinking she gone and shit. <laughs> no, I How you thought she was gone? gone? You ain't seen her leave? Shit. Yeah, I thought she been gone. <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm here for moral support so she can roast it. Yes, it looked a little tight. She banned me from getting on my lap. Yeah, because he don't know how to act. But anyways, oh, and that's another thing I got to roast you husband about to. What? Stop. But anyways. I'm going to get out so she can this, roast me. Hoes. This out. Sunday, this Sunday he texted me and was like he was on the way. But mind you, he was supposed to come Friday and Saturday. Never came. And me and my mama was sitting up waiting on his ass. So this Sunday that he popped up in my house, my mom was at the emergency room. So I was going to tell his ass, no, he couldn't come that day anyways because I didn't want to see him. I didn't want to be in his face like I just told y'all. Anytime he came over there, I made sure my mom was at home. So I could be upstairs in my room and he could be downstairs with his daughter. So he came. No, he texted and was like, he was on the way. I ha ha the shit. Like he told y'all, I laughed. Yes, that's what the fuck I did. I ha ha the you shit. Never say yes. That's what I'm saying. You never say no. You, no, no. If I no. never text back or never say yes, don't when you tell your ass, no, my no. When home. you tell somebody you on the way, don't you wait for them to say okay for you to even leave the house and be on the way? Exactly. But you didn't say no. I'm like, get the fuck out. I'm just saying, bro. But if he was still gonna come, it could have been. Come from female, you know what I'm bro, no, bro. No, no, it don't. don't. Because me and him had just got into it their Friday. Their Friday. No, fuck it, don't. No. What does it mean if your female say you can? If she didn't say don't come, what does it mean? I'm not his bitch, though, so that's a totally different thing. For one, that's. Why Disrespect. So you popping up in my seat. Come on. You don't know what I have going on. You don't even know. Shut your ass up. <laughs> 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 Get out. Oh, I'm trying to talk to them. All right. <laughs> <laughs> but no. This Sunday, he texted me like he was on the way. I had just hot hot the shit. And it was morning time. So I had got a shower. Stop! Put him in the 
in the shower. And when I got out, hold on, I don't, I don't even know what the fuck he said. But anyway, when I had got out the shower, he was like, he was on the way. By the time I dried off, bruh, like I dried off and put on a t-shirt. I ain't even put on no drawers, no shorts or shit. He texted me again, was like, um, no, 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 no. He didn't even say he was outside food. When, when he, was, he said he was on the way, this nigga was pulling up. No, when he said he was on the way, he was like, in my neighborhood, my mama neighborhood, longest in the hood to my house, it took like eight minutes just to get to the to, to the real street. So when he texted me and said he was on the way, he was already in my neighborhood. Like, so when I got out the shower, we heard him pulling up. I was he pulling full, and my mama, my mama stayed in a nice ass neighborhood. Like, some of y'all know where my mama stayed. Like, in a nice ass neighborhood full of woods and shit. And me and Bryson was going together long enough for him to know, like, you can't come in my neighborhood playing loud ass music and shit. He pulled up playing loud ass music. Like, I heard him pull up playing loud ass music. He ain't even text and say, I'm outside or shit. Like, in the way he told y'all, I need bum ass live bullshit. He got on time out. He knocked on the door nicely. Who, who the fuck would even get on live saying this shit? Explaining how you knocked on the door. Bitch, that mean you know how you knocked on the door. He beat on the door. He was, bro, like, times. he was in a one-minute time span. Is you gonna give somebody time to open Fool, I didn't even get a chance to drive off all the way. Like, he pulled up, ringing the fuck out my doorbell, like, ringing my doorbell, beating on the door, beating on the door. At this, mo at this point, it wasn't even... A minute didn't even go by. He didn't even give me a chance to go downstairs. And at this point, bitch, I still didn't have to let you in my house because you popped up in my shit. You were supposed to come Friday and Saturday and never came. I never gave you the okay to pop up in my shit Sunday. And I know I didn't tell him that because my mom was in the hospital. Again, my mom was supposed to be there when he comes so I don't have to fucking see him. So... I went downstairs, like, I'm still trying to rush and put on my clothes and shit. Because from my window, you can't see the front door, but you can see, like, the end of the driveway. So, this, when I went downstairs, I opened the door, I'm like, don't pop up over here being on my door like you crazy. He pushed me up the way and was like, fool, watch out, I'm trying to see my daughter. So, you bogart your way in my motherfucking house. In my mama house at that, this not even, that wasn't even my house where I paid bills to. You pop up in my mama house, bug on your way in my motherfucking front door, telling me you trying to see your daughter. I'm like, okay, still, like, don't come over here doing too much. He still on that hot shit, like, doing the most, telling me what the fuck he gonna do in my mama shit. So I'm like, fool, go on here, my mama ain't even here for you to be coming over here to see her anyways. So he's still like pushing me out the way and she, mind you, it's a camera right by my front door. Like my front door, the stairs right in front of, um, like right beside the front door. So the camera can see all this shit while he trying to get on this internet shit line. It's a fucking camera in my house and on the outside of my house by my garage, seeing all this shit. He pushing me out the way, walking around, pacing back and forth downstairs, looking for clothes. She was upstairs with Michaela. So he like, I'm trying to see my daughter, where my daughter at? I'm like, bro, go on road food, cause you come over here on some hot ass shit doing the most. He already came over there mad, bitch, because you pop over here being on my door and ringing my doorbell. Basically telling me to hurry the fuck up and let you in. You ain't even been standing outside of her mini yet. So he's still pacing back and forth downstairs. Excuse me. Trying to find her. So I'm like, like I said, I told him to go. So he tried to go upstairs, like he told y'all. Like, Bruh, this man basically snitched on himself when he was on that YouTube shit. After I'm coming to tell him to leave, he said on his own live that he tried to go up my stairs and get her. Like, and y'all dumb as hell because y'all not listening to what the fuck he's saying. On his shit, he, he snitched on himself the whole time. He said he... We're still trying to come see his daughter after I'm constantly telling him to leave. If somebody tell you to leave, bitch, you're in my shit. Get the fuck out. And you push me out. You basically walk out of your way in my house anyway. So, 
this nigga tried to go up the steps. So at this point, like, you're in my shit after I'm cussing him, you leave. So I'm trying to get him off the steps, and my stepdad was there. My stepdad be minding his business, though. So, like, when when he know we, we be having company, he just stays in the room. Uh uh. These comments. Nah, the questions. Oh. Finish telling the story. Wait. Answer the question. I'm just I'm telling comments back on when I get done talking. But anyways, he was still. You ain't gonna be able to see it because the comments are. I mean, I can see the questions. You're trying to read it. Then what are you doing? <laughs> but it's not so goofy. But anyways, he was trying to bogart his. Stop. Stop. What did he say? Let me see what he said. But he was at this point. We yelling at each other. I'm constantly telling him to get out. You need to go because you come over here. Stop. You come over here. On that hot ass shit, like, you need to calm down. Then, you mad as fuck. Trying to see Clover and shit. Anything could happen. Like, he could have, bro, like, it was just so much shit going on. So, he's still trying to run up the steps and get her. At this point, I'm pulling him out the steps. I'm like, bro, just leave, fool. Like, you can come back with my mama get here. You're just not finna see her right now, like, get the fuck out. They basically fighting. Yeah, it's like, I'm it's trying to wild. pull him I'm trying to pull him off the steps. So, I had called my stepdaddy. No, like, no, no, I'm upstairs. I hear all this go from it. I put Clover down in her bassinet. I go on the steps. These folks, this man is swinging and fighting, basically. Bro, like, he was swinging on me and shit. I'm like, fool, just leave. Like, you doing too much. So, by the time he... I almost got up the steps. I had called my stepdaddy. No, he heard us. She so, didn't even call us. No, her. I didn't call my stepdaddy. I was like, Troy, because... What was your bitch and your boyfriend doing now? <laughs> <laughs> but no, he... I it was somebody. Uh-uh. What's your bitch and your boyfriend? So we best be fighting at the bottom of the steps. Once again, where the camera is. The camera is, like, facing directly on the steps in the front door. Like, you can see all this shit. You can see him swinging on me, all this, like... We got to find my stepdaddy. My sister blocked, like, like, K blocked the steps. K was standing at the top of the steps, trying to get him off me. My stepdaddy finally came and got him off me and was trying to get him out the house. So, all this shit going on, we fighting. He's swinging at me, I'm swinging at him. My, my trying to get him off the steps. My stepdaddy trying to get him off the steps. My stepdaddy ended up getting him out the house. They had to carry him out the house. Yeah, it's like, Pick this nigga, and this nigga got on, the house. this nigga got on his YouTube talking about some, he was attacked. You attacked us. He came in my house, in my mama's house, trying to bug out his way up the steps. He had already pushed me away from the front door, so, that's, that's strike one, you already put your hands on me, you done basically broke in my fucking house. Trying to see Clover. And I tell him, come back later. You can come back later when my mama get here. Like, this shit uncalled for. I never told him he could not see Clover. I ain't never, never told this man he couldn't see his baby. Never told him this shit. I was letting him come over there any time of the day, any time of the night to see her. Letting him bring his whole motherfucking family over there. Knowing I don't fuck with them folks. Knowing they don't fuck with me, bitch. See, all this shit could have been avoided, bro. Like, now she old enough to go over here to my house. But now it's a wrap. It's done. Like I'm done, fool. Like that was the last straw. I should have been should have been cut that shit off when he got on this shit bragging about shooting at me. I was like, finish telling the story. You didn't even finish telling when he finally got out of the house. Oh, oh. He got out the house. He gonna yell. He was like, like bro, shut up. He was like, where my Draco? Where my Draco? And it was a cop full of niggas outside, so you pulling up to my house with all these niggas, letting these niggas know my mama and everybody else lay their head in. I don't know these fuckers. You bringing all these niggas to my house, like. So when he finally got, when he finally got out the house, he started hollering to us, where my Draco, where my Draco? So I ran upstairs and got clothing and sat on the floor. 
Cause this nigga told me I wear his Draco at. I started hearing gunshots. This nigga shot at my house while my daughter was in the house. While his daughter was in the house. And y'all sitting there pissing me out. I'm keeping my baby away from him. It ain't even it. To this day, I still had my mama drop her off at his house. But it's not me. It's the police. My stepdaddy caught the police on him. And the police came. Oh, and that's not to mention. This nigga. It's over? What is the second? Uh, I was trying to. Why you can't pick? It has to be recent. I think you can only do the recent photos. Damn. I was trying to show y'all what they might do to my garage. I have. Uh, go to it. But anyway, oh, he went outside. <laughs> he went outside, and I had ran upstairs. To get, and I sat on the floor with her, like behind my door, because my room, my room is full of windows, and my room had a bathroom in it. I couldn't go in the bathroom because it was a long bathroom too. So I had just sat on the floor with Clover, because this nigga talking about where is Draco at. So, and he did exactly what I knew he was going to do. He shot at my fucking house while my baby was in there. And, and did shit to my garage. But I don't, I don't even get on live. I don't know how to work this shit. This nigga put a big ass hole in my mama's garage. This not even my house. This is my mama's house. Where my mama pay bills at. Like, not only you trying to fuck up my shit, but my mama stay there too. So, like. You fucking up where my mama stay at. We had to get that shit fixed. Exactly, fool. Like, y'all, y'all gonna listen to a nigga that get on Twitter thinking he can move water and fire and shit. The nigga is ill, bitch. That nigga is sick. Like, y'all, y'all know I don't get on this hoe telling my business. I don't get on this hoe doing none of the attention seeking ass shit before ain't nobody finna keep playing with my motherfucking name. I ain't no bitter ass baby mama. I ain't never been no bitter ass bitch. I ain't got shit to be bitter about, period. <laughs> nigga get on social media. Crying like who the fuck does that? Y'all know I don't get on this shit telling my bitch. I don't even get on this shit. I don't get on live none of this shit. Like Tyrese. What? Even yeah. when Tyrese is crying about his daughter. <laughs> who? Tyrese, the ball head singer. <laughs> when? This is a little while ago. He was crying. No, y'all gotta show me. Why is boo boo crying because he wants to see his kids? But no, so when the police came, bro, it was like, bro, that shit is embarrassing. I don't, I don't even fuck with.